I got a wire hanger. Is that you? What the hell are you doing wearing a mask? Ugh, what kind of mask is that? It looks ridiculous. And before you ask, no, I have not been creative. I have not, I haven't had the motivation or inspiration and the mask helps with that. What do you do with it? You just, just put it on? No, what the hell? <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel sick to my stomach. That was too much. Why the shoes? I can't walk. Ooh, I can't walk in these. So this is supposed to give me what exactly? <clears throat> oh my God. Suddenly I'm like artistic. I don't know what to, I don't know. What's up my juicy friends? Thank you for hopping back on to another video. Excuse the sun, please. It is going in and out and it's kind of driving me insane. So let me give you a little taste on what we're going to be doing in these next couple weeks. So as you guys know, I don't like the color grill. I don't like the color. The color. Hold on. The color green, the color green. It's not my favorite color. It's not a color that is easy blended. It just has always been a little difficult for me to use the color green. Whether it's mixing things, making things look pretty, landscapes, I just can't do it. To overcome that, I will be doing six artworks, six characters, and six different mediums, and six videos. So I don't know if you got a clue from uh, the intro. We're gonna be doing the mask. Jim Carrey's The Mask, not the second one. We don't talk about the second one. This intro is long enough, but I do want to review a green candy. I got this from Dollar Tree. It's called Boogers. Ooh. <sighs> that is strong as hell. I love these. Bursting with fruit flavor. I love boogers. So without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, spin into this video. <laughs> Come on. Come on, gotta get spooky. Well, hello. Well, to start things off, this is my drawing pad. It's a Strathmore drawing pad. It's the same one I always use, 400 series. This is me digging through all my oil pastels, trying to find the greens, the yellows, some beiges for the lips and teeth. Now, this is me not doing no woof waffin. I don't do no woof waffin. I get straight into the sketch, as always. Now, where do I begin with this sketch? Uh, it was kind of a mess. The face, I was really confident in, but as you can see from the, the shape of the body, the shape of the head, it was just a nightmare. Uh, I did not know what direction I wanted to go into. I was looking at about three different reference photos, but I was looking at a main one for the face because I liked the shadow on it. It looked a little more simple. I did kind of mess up the other side of the face, but we're not going to really pay attention to that. I, I kind of like the ripples of the face. It makes it look chunky, a little thick, if you know what I mean. But enough about all that. Let's go ahead and get into why I don't like the color green. Why is green? Why? 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 Why is the color green so... so why am I hung up on it? Let's start with the history. Middle school, you know how you're getting those, like crayons oil pastels markers and you're making landscapes you're coloring grass well i hated coloring grass i hated using the color green whether it was a marker a crayon a oil pastel i just could not it always turned to mud i did not know how colors worked back then i still kind of don't i still kind of just hope for the best but that's probably where it stemmed from is landscapes and coloring grass and all this other crap i can i'm sorry uh, let me breathe anyways moving along i've noticed that you know when i was starting to get more into art around late middle school early high school i just realized i didn't use that much color and just in general i didn't use a lot of color but when i started to reach into the color when i started to dip my toes into the rainbow essence i didn't really pick up the color green I, I feel like it was subconscious, some consciousness, some consciousness, subconsciousness. What do you know what I mean? I feel like it was all in my head. I just never really used green. I Here's the thing. I did use green sometimes, I will say. And some like splashes there and here. and But I never really, never really used the color green. I always thought of the color green being used in like landscapes, uh, forests, you know. Bob Ross very much. I did portraits. I did funky little portraits. 
Why did why why do I need to be using the color green? I just never used it. I like I said, I used the splashes there, splashes here, but never really fully emerged and dipped my twos into the color green. Now I hate to disappoint you. I probably thought that I was, you know, had some bad beef with green. Something happened. There was an incident. There was no incident. Nothing bad happened. I just actually scratch that i every drawing that i made with green like a long time ago when i didn't really know how to work colors would turn gray brown but 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 i want to also say this damn these teeth let me tell you i spent a lot of time on these freaking teeth only to find out i didn't record any of it you see that what the oh i was so pissed. oh i'm so mad but the teeth look good, huh? Anyways, what I was going to say is the only real color greens that I've used, uh, like, you know, a few years ago when I just never used it, was the ones that came out of the Crayola pack. Was the, the I think there was three greens. There's dark green, medium green, and then lime green. Those are the only greens I really used. Now, using, having used like a million different oil pastels, I feel like, I hate to say this, ew. <laughs> I'm not saying that. Oh my gosh, y'all, y'all didn't hear nothing. Um, but uh, I, I kind of like, I kind of like some shades of green. <clears throat> Shut up. Shut up. Now, before I dig myself in a hole, let's go ahead and talk about why I chose the mask for this first drawing. Part of the reason why is because I couldn't think of any other, you know, green character to make that I liked. Um, I was gonna do like comic book, but. I thought the comic books aren't really that spooky. There was no green comic book character that's spooky. Besides Poison Ivy, I was thinking about doing Poison Ivy, but I changed my mind. Um, because I don't know, she. I just don't know enough about comic book characters. So I, I know a lot about the mask. I love the movie. Love Jim Carrey. I mean, what else? What else is there to say? It's been a hot minute actually since I've watched this movie. Funny enough. That pro that the intro of this video is probably so stupid it has nothing to do with the movie. <laughs> I haven't seen the movie in so long. I should probably watch it tonight. Mm. I'm low key pulling an all nighter because my sleeping schedule is all effed up. But um, anyways, this is the shirt. So he's wearing like two different outfits in my reference photos, and I chose this one because I feel like the yellow suit is the main main costume. And sadly, I did not film most of this most of the shirt because i'm actually really proud of the shirt i didn't even feel most of it so this is the base um but i didn't get me you know doing the refinements of it but anyways that's kind of the gist of what it looks like um i did not like the tie i thought the tie was kind of stupid like the way i drew it i thought it was a cute tie just not the way i like drew it but whatever then I'm doing the pink background, of course, the green and pink. Those are the only two color combos that I like will like with green. So you might be seeing that a lot during these uh, these green series. Anyways, but uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. We're almost done. I had to do the scratchy scratch. I had to. <sighs> oh my gosh. Y'all okay? I'm okay. I promise. But here's some close-ups. I think the close-ups are so juicy. It's so freaking juicy. It's done. It is done. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned because I'm going to start talking here in a second. It's so juicy. Ugh. Great way to start off the spooky season, if you ask me. Sometimes you can tell when a drawing is going to go downhill just from the sketch, and I did not think I would like this at all. The sketch was scaring me a little bit. But once I got this eye done, I was like, ooh, this is starting to get a little juicy. I'm kind of liking it. Now, like I said, this is only the beginning. There's a lot more green that I have to get through. Please give this a like, and if you want, please subscribe and click that little bell so you know when I post, cause I am a little random. Now in this little series that I'm gonna be doing, I hope to post every Wednesday and Sunday. So stay tuned every Wednesday and Sunday. Also don't forget to comment below and let me know what green character you think I'm gonna do next. And as always, stay juicy, stay creative. If you have any questions, concerns, please let me know down below and watch some of my other stuff if you want. Go draw something today or do something creative. Or watch a spooky movie. It's spooky season. I don't know what to tell you. Bye.